Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Bushido Blade. In the last episode, we started uh, slashing around with a red shadow. Yeah, I think that's it. And uh, we uh, got about one or two more fights left after this chick, so let's just get it started. Wait for her to shut up. And let's kill her off. <laughs> that was pretty easy. Like, look, if you're going to let me attack, I will kill you. She got some big feet. I'm sorry. I couldn't hold back. That's all right. She was trying to kill you. So did I finish, follow the code that fight? Yes, I did. This is the last guy. Your sword is stained with the blood of your fallen comrades. Even though he's got his own voice. Do you think you're going to kill me with it? Well, yeah, duh, you're old. Come on, go ahead and attack. Hello? Yeah, that's what I thought. I'd shut the fuck up, too. Come on, go ahead and attack. I, I allow it. My sword is back behind me. There's no way it can... Here, I'll put it over my head. My, head, my sword is up here. Attack. No, I said attack, not back up. Okay, you attacked. That wasn't planned like that. Okay, I'll just murder the motherfucker. How about that? Yeah, shut up. Yeah, you let me know when you're in your stance. You're in your stance. You're dead. You can run with the L1 button, by the way. I don't know if I said that in the last episode. And you can attack while you're running, and it does some stronger attacks. Certainly, even killing a machine like you must have had doubts. Even a killing machine like you, that's it. Is he humping the floor? Wait, what? What is she gonna do? Huh. We'll go jump off a cliff. Well, yeah, you killed a bunch of people. Of course you're gonna be alone. Ooh, pretty. See, everybody's got some different... I'm not going to show the credits right now. I'll wait until I beat all of, with all of them. I think everybody's got a different ending if you don't get hit. And I'm really not going to worry about showing everybody that. But here's the entrance, or one of the entrances, or intros, not entrances, for the game. You can just see all the people. Yeah, I really don't even want to show this, honestly. No offense, but... So, we beat one get person story mode, so I figured I'd show y'all some different modes before we get into the next person. And that's POV mode now. I mean, if you've taken an English class or something, you know what POV stands for, and that's point of view. So I'm just going to pick some random person. Let's get the Black Lotus, and we'll put Tatsumi. I'll get the Broadsword, and... He can have the broadsword, too. But yeah, I like this little part of the uh, game. and I'll go here for the hell of it. I'll have to lose to go back to the uh, main menu screen, but I figured I'd just show it once or twice. And get to actually fight. <laughs> You can still block and still hit like normally. And you got bamboos all around us. That's why we're in the bamboo thicket. And I just slashed his fucking head off. Let's watch that in replay. I just decided to run. And goodbye. You have no head.
Yeah, that's right. I win. Continue and yeah, if you die, you can still continue. But that's that mode. Link mode, I think, is the two players. And here you can find the endings for everybody. You get a demo. I don't know what that means. Options. Let's see. I've got it on easy because I suck at this game. Not like it matters. They're both pretty hard because you still got to follow the thing. First mode, one or two people. Slash mode, I think a bunch of opponents just come after you and you got to defeat them one by one. Uh, training mode, you play with wooden weapons. It's kind of funny. So we'll just hop back into story mode and go to the next guy, which is Tatsumi, I think. Tatsumi? I don't know how to pronounce him. So we'll get this guy. He's pretty quick, so I'm going to get... What do I want? I want the... No, he's too weak for that. Well, I guess not. We'll try the Nodachi. The Noda no Nodachi sword. I don't know if I'm pronouncing anything right, and I don't care. Now, we've already seen that, so I'm going to skip that. Yeah, we just heard that. You're going to kill him. Kill them all. Because now you're an assassin. If you know the assassins, you are an assassin. Not really. I don't really know what I'm trying to say. Let's just start fighting now. Can we start fighting? Okay, here we go. Let's have a clean fight. No, I want a very, very dirty fight. Yeah. Yeah, you're dead. After that one hit, I figured he would die, but I think that one that cut his brain out killed him, you know. That's just my opinion. Yeah, you, you definitely killed him. For the first time in my life. Well, you know how to use a sword pretty well if that's the first time. Now you get to take a chick's life. How do you feel about that? Oh, you cut that titty right off. I said, goodbye, titty. I never thought I would have to kill you. I wonder what they're about to do. Even though she's dead, that's real kinky. That's too kinky. He's murdered two people in like 15 seconds. Now we're taking on some the Incredible... Never mind. I was going to say we're taking on like the Incredible Hulk or something. And then he killed me. Let's try this again. Yeah. You are now in two. I don't need to watch that replay. I saw what happened. I can't believe I beat you. I've never killed anybody before, and I just killed a professional assassin. Because, you know, that makes perfect sense. Squaresoft makes some weird shit up sometimes. And now we're taking on Red Shadow, the chick that I just beat the game with. And she just stabbed me. And somehow my second slice went right through her. That was crazy. And I just... I just fucked her up. Fucked her world up. There's no way I'm going to die. You're gonna die one day, don't worry. So now we get to watch the queer run. I mean, look how gay that looks. I could have made him run a little better looking. I mean, understand, this is when, this is around when Final Fantasy VII came out and everything, so polygons were in, but no. No, that just looks horrible. Now, right now, there should be a loading screen, but because I'm on an emulator and I'm using an ISO, it kind of sucks. I like how he says, did I, every time. He's got a long-ass spear, but now he's dead. So now we'll find out if I've been following the code or not. Don't need to watch the replay. I saw it already. Should have turned and run away? How was he standing? I just... Oh. I think he's dead now. Did I follow the code? I think I did. I think I did. Did I? 
Yes, I did. Hey, well, I'll you Shut the fuck up. Oh, you're still alive. No, you're not. Yeah, you got fucked up, sir. So, alright, we beat the gun guy pretty quickly. Yeah, we are. Hanzaki. Yep. In the next episode of Let's Play Soul Blazer. What the fuck? Let's play Bushido Blade. We will take on this guy. I, I, who I don't really even know who this is. And I, I think about it. But we'll take him on in the next episode. Thanks for watching, guys. I've been Tiger Zero signing off. Have a good day.